Great sound, Lee Kern again with the Wolf Brothers, Till It Ends. And before that, Blur uh, coming up to a song from Jacob's Run, Wayne with you. Finishing up uh, this week uh, in country Victoria, I've really enjoyed my time here. Just uh, further on that story of the uh, terrible truck crash uh, on the Western Highway, the border of uh, SA and Victoria with the uh, big build-up of traffic there at 2am on Thursday morning. Thursday night, Emma Keeley, who is the member for Lowen, posted this, an absolute horrific three-truck collision happened this morning. My heart goes out to the family, friends and workmates of the deceased driver and his fellow truckies who now have to deal with another death, their workplace, um, which is the road. Special mention to the local CFA volunteers and other emergency service volunteers and workers who attended the collision and were first on the scene after a year of border closure, uncertainty, changes and frustration for you to be the first responders to a traumatic fatal incident relating to another border closure must be harrowing. Please reach out if there is any support you need and that the office of Emma Keeley is available, she says, along with the Beyond Blue 1300 224 636. She then says, I urge governments of all colours and persuasions to deeply consider the impact of border closures permits and failure to communicate and work with neighbouring states. There is more than just the one risk of transmitting COVID in managing this pandemic. Please remember this when making any decision that impacts on the lives and livelihoods of your constituents and fellow Australian citizens. Yes, I think that says it all. Getting out and about, uh, looking forward to meeting you if you're in Hopeton or uh, over at uh, Wemmerlang or Speed or up in uh, the beautiful town of Ogan. Got up uh, to Rainbow yesterday. I noticed that uh, their school there has uh, got some grant to money from government, about 11.5 bill to do an upgrade, which is incredible. The Albuquerque Silo getting some painting done to it. I had a little quick look up there. And Shillings' is flour mill, apparently, the old silo there in uh, the heart of town, getting an internal mural with some lights, I think, I believe uh, could be happening there and the Enduro is happening in Rainbow March 6 and 7 called the Rainbow Rise 240 the Victorian Off-Road Championships lots of things happening in our towns um, people in uh, Rainbow said to make sure you uh, don't forget to say good day to us and uh, put out uh, all of the things that are happening that are so positive in our community they even told me about a uh, lake that's going to get some water south of the town which will be terrific for swimming and boating and so on so a lot of good things in our country towns happening happening and uh, great to be able to bring them to you here on the Flow Morning Show. Don't forget Jace and his new team on Friday night tonight. We're going to have Ellis and also Dan join Jace. I'll be out and about here talking to you on the road, but looking forward to hearing the program. Bye for now.